Welcome back to Passport Style, everybody. As those of you who follow me on Instagram know, we have a very special video for today. I made a very large investment into capital recently. And the purpose of this purchase, like a lot of my other purchases, is to resell a lot of it. That's how I keep this cycle going. A few of you asked me, you know, how, how are you able to afford all this? And uh, I can just tell you in full transparency, you know, I'm investing in a lot of my savings into clothes. I think it's fun for me. And I actually do make decent returns with a lot of the stuff that I'm selling. And it's just enough to continue this cycle. So for today's video, I'm gonna keep it a little light on the details behind the products themselves. I will follow up with videos on the grails and tell you more about the pieces individually. For this video, we're gonna keep it surface level to show you all the really cool stuff that I got, get some shots of the pieces. And without further ado, let's get into it. This box is absolutely gigantic. I had a friend ship this to me from Japan. Very fortunate to have that connection and thank you, buddy. Uh, this video is dedicated to you today. And just look at the size. I'm um, really happy to be able to share this with everyone. And before we get started, please leave a comment down below with your favorite piece at the end of this video. Let's do it. So here's how we're gonna do it. We're gonna go from top to bottom. I will just get out everything. I'll show you what it looks like. And then at the end, I will sort of have a lookbook video of all the pieces hanging up. So off the top, let's see what letter uh, Capital wrote me. See if I can even read it, if it's in English. Probably not. Sealed letter from Capital. Okay, we do have an English side, a Japanese side. <laughs> All right, so um, table of contents, it, it tells you about their denim, their repair policy, um, maintaining your products, their tailoring service. This is really interesting. I, I think that's unique. That's a nice touch. We have our list of contents, which will be in the description and the price I paid. And then on the top of the pile, a grail in itself, one of the vests in a size four, I should say. It's really big. This is the light blue, I believe they call it saxophone color of that Keel hand done vest. And this is much bigger than the three. We'll show a shots of all of these at the end of the video. Next up in the box, it's another vest. We are deep in grail territory. This one's a size three. This is the color, my personal favorite. This is their, I think they call it Kinari. It's that light or off white and white bandana print. Let's put it to the side. The magic does not stop. Next up, another vest in a size three. This is the red. Wow. Again, also hand done, uh, hand weaved, I should say, with hints of blue. That's what really attracted me to this color. They use what's available. And I really like that in the red color specifically, they tend to have at least a couple splotches of blue. Really a work of art in my opinion. And the last vest, we have it in the black as well, also a size three. Again, hand done. Man. Absolutely love this. So that was the end of the vests, but some of the accessories and the pair of pants that I also got are very, very cool to me. And the first one, this is actually a scarf. So this is sort of like an infinity scarf. If you've ever owned one of those, it's just an endless loop. And then you can um, tie it around itself, make some interesting knots. And this just had a really cool look to it, in my opinion. I think could look really good with a vest or in another outfit completely, but just so capital. And um, capital with a K 
for this brand. And then uh, staying in the accessories category, this is a, uh, a beanie, not a bandana. Uh, this is their black pink colorway. Um, sounds like the K-pop group, which I thought was funny and is one of the reasons I ended up buying it. This little patch here says peace activist. Looks like Mahatma Gandhi, honestly, for the walking stick. And then uh, this is a capital country piece. I'll talk a little bit more about the pieces and the brand in separate videos. We got socks, and we got socks. I saw on other retailer websites, Capital Socks had a massive markup in the US. I got three pairs of socks knowing that I could probably sell them for double, um, or at least keep one pair for myself. This is the pink and uh, I think navy polka dot. I think um, green, and it looks like an off-white. That could also go with a lot of different shoes that I have. Back to hats, um, this is more of a jumbo beanie so it has more of that slouch on the back end which i personally look for in a beanie um, i'm not a huge fan of like those short beanies that just cover you know a quarter of your head same peace activist patch in a darker pink and then another really cool item for me so maybe you already know what this is maybe you don't i hope you don't this is um, a bag so this is a crossbody bag i bought it in the larger size I want to say and um, Capital is also known for those bandana snuffkin bags is what they call them basically a bandana print you know wrap around crossbody bag I personally like this rising sun sort of Japan flag looking uh, denim bag and I wanted to be a little bit different and sell something um, that isn't quite as often seen on Grailed and other platforms so that was my impetus behind getting this design specifically and then we have a waffle knit shirt. This is a gift, you know who you are. Did not get this in my own size, but a very cool, this is the only shirt I actually got. Um, again, we'll have another close-up shot, but green waffle knit. Waffle knit, as, as you'll see every fall, a lot of people stock it, um, but seems to be particularly in style this season. We've got three more items if you're trying to pace yourself, drinking your soda or popcorn. I uh, will do two at once. These are bandanas. So I bought two bandanas from Capital. Very cool colorways. This one was sold out in the black and like neon green. I'll, I'll show you what it looks like um, in just a second. And then this one is, is their uh, like tennis, outer space, sci-fi sort of theme. Uh, it says all cotton capital on it, and I'll show you what it looks like again. The reason I wanted to get bandanas is because what I learned from a Japanese blog post um, using Google Translate is that they actually suggest you use a capital bandana and tie that into those weaves of the keel vests. And I just thought that was such a great idea, and I saw a picture on a blog, and I wanted to try that myself. So I got two bandanas, and then the last purchase from this drop, drum roll please, we have a, again, I think it's their saxophone color bandana print sweatpants in a size three, I believe. This was just too cool not to get. Again, wanted to get something a little different from what I always see on the grilled platforms. I think like the safest purchase probably would have been something like the Snufkin bag or, or another bandana print item or something along the lines of denim and a jacket or some jeans, which is what Capital is known for. But this is a little different. I think can probably sell pretty well. You know, I'm a sucker for this Japanese bandana print stuff. So um, another thing that I'm really excited to have. So if you're still with me in this video, keep watching all the way to the end. I'm gonna show you some really cool shots of each product.
Thanks for watching everyone. Uh, I can't do this sort of thing very often unless I have many, many more subscribers. So please hit the sub button, share with a friend and like it in that order. I'll see you guys next time.